photos are nice and organized, what are you going to do now? Well, you could just box them up and put them on a shelf somewhere. But I really highly um, recommend that you have your photos scanned and turn them into digital files. And there's two reasons for this. One is to protect your files. What happens if a tornado hits your house? You're not going to be sad that you lost your favorite pair of shoes. You might be a little sad, but you won't be as sad as if you lost all your precious photographs. So scanning them gives you a digital version that you can save and have for generations. The second reason why it's important to digitize your photos is because you want them back in your life. You want to be able to make a photo book or frame a picture that's maybe too small to be put in a frame now. There's a couple of ways that you can do the scanning process. If you're a DIY person, you can invest in a nice scanner. They're not that expensive. Um, and do it yourself. You could also hire someone, either send your things to a scanning company or use someone like myself that does more of a white glove service that scans people's photos. Um, so there's a wide variety of things you can do. And let's just talk real quick about the kinds of scanners that you can use. This is a flatbed scanner that I use for uh, larger pictures. It just goes on, it just works like a copy machine. It also can be used to do multiple pictures at once, and they will all come out as separate files on my computer. This is a high-speed scanner that I use in, in my office. But you just put the pictures in. This scanner is good if you have a lot of pictures of the same size and are in really good condition. One thing I would caution you against if you're going to scan your own photos is using just your standard 4-in-1 uh, printer scanner. These are not really made for photographs, um, so your quality is not going to be as good. And if you're going to invest the time in this process, you might as well do it right. So whether you scan your own pictures or you get someone else to do it for you, it's a very important step in the process of organizing your printed photos.